Oh, look how many gets out. Between them, these are very impressive figures. They've sold 15 million records. They've won three Brit Awards. They've not stopped 14 number one singles. Before they come out here, here's just a few of those singles. Look at these. It's all about it's you. All about you. Please welcome McBusted! Right. You have to bring the bigger couch out for you. You still only just three yeah. dollars. We can do it. Okay, we're well, looking good. Look at that. Right. Wow. Oh, and now, now you're in. making everyone feel uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, so, McBusted, how did this come about? What is, what's brought this un unholy union of bands together? Emerging. Uh, yeah, it actually, uh, it was really, it, it wasn't planned. It just started. I went to Manchester to visit McFly, you know, because we're friends and stuff. Okay. And, um, <laughs> and then... Uh, you know, they were like, it'd be funny if you uh, went out and sung some songs. And uh, it went, like, so well. And then, you know, that night, uh, our manager, he came up to the hotel and was like, showed me a long list of arena dates. And they were like, you know, we think that, you know, promoters believe you can do this. Wow. And then they announced the tour and we just... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we just, we had breakfast and the agent rang 15 minutes after the tickets went on sale and they were all gone. Wow. Yeah. The agent had bought all the tickets. <laughs> <laughs> and, no, but you, you auditioned uh, for Busted, didn't you? I did, yeah. Back in, so before you McFly. So this, in a way, this is, it's a self-fulfilling prophecy. Yeah, well, I was in for like 24 hours or so. Well, I thought I was in for about So you thought you were hours. actually in Busted? I got told I was in Busted. I was at the same audition that Charlie was in. Right. Okay. So when they met Charlie, we, we met at the same time. And then, um, so I got told I was in. And then, uh, and then a couple of days later, on Halloween, I got a call from... And I'm just saying, actually, they're just going to keep it with the three of them. Oh, wow. Yeah. And so Matt, and Jay, Matt and Tom went to the same school. And Matt, you didn't really, you didn't really like Tom, did you? This is where it gets a little bit awkward. <laughs> no, it's not that I didn't like Tom. It's just, um, you know, we, we were very different people. Well, you look very different types. We, we are quite different. Yeah, we are different. Yeah, yeah. because... Well, are... we're probably the most alike now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, because you look nerdish and, and sort of still quite shy, and you look like you've just come from a gay bar. <laughs> <laughs> There's no way is that a negative comment to me. I don't know uh, what you're talking about. So what's the deal with Charlie then? Because he, he quit when Busted were, were as big as you yeah, could was, be. Yeah, it was still it? getting really big and it was quite a shock to me when he left. Um, I didn't want it. To, I didn't want it to end. You didn't know. know that he'd left. Yeah, I, did, I didn't really know that he. How left. did you not know? No wonder he left if you didn't even know. <laughs> yeah, but I guess that people didn't tell me because I would have been the most sad, you know, about him leaving. Well, uh, tell them what you did when when Busted split up. Uh, well, we, it was a bit different, but I mean, I was just in my apartment. I just played Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> and, uh, I didn't, I really, you know, my phone was just ringing, like, and going, I didn't answer it, I just, uh, you know... So how long did you play Grand Theft Auto? Until, until the end of the game, and then when I finished the game, <laughs> I was like, what do I do now? And it was just a very Hold on, so the only backup plan you had for not being in a bag <laughs> was for, for running a mock in Grand Theft Auto. Exactly. If he wanted to join McBusted, obviously, A, we'd need a bigger couch, but <laughs> would you welcome him back? Would you want him back, or would it be too weird knowing that he left and um, didn't I, want to be part of it? Well, I think um, we, we, all, we all like Charlie. You know, we don't have a problem with Charlie, and um, I think we'd like him to come back, you know, but it's up to him. Um, Dougie, we love your look. <laughs> <laughs> Got it all going on, Dougie boy. Got it all going on, Dougie boy. Oh, we love the pop socks. <laughs> <laughs> and me and Bradley, me and Bradley are forming White Walsh. <laughs> yeah. I don't know how many 
Yeah. 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 Okay, and uh, you're dating Ellie Goulding at the moment, is this fine? I've seen you out with her all the time. We're, we're friends. <laughs> <laughs> Why do people always get so coy when you ask if they're going out together? Uh, that was awkward, wasn't it? That could be anyone. That's how embarrassing it is to be with you, dude. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Don't be wearing that hat. Again. Yeah. 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 Well, I hope that works out for you. I hope it does. Thank you very much. Like a nice, she's a very nice young woman, and it's a nice... Uh, Cheers, thank you. Okay. <laughs> uh, so, guys, the question is, I know you haven't spoken about this, but uh, I imagine fans of both bands would like to see new material from you as this new amalgamated band. Is that going to happen? Are you going to bring out a new album? We always said um, that we, we weren't, we weren't going to say we were going to bring out music because we didn't want to go and say we're going to make, make music and it'd be terrible. Yeah. But, um, but we went away. We did some writing, yeah. and it wasn't <laughs> terrible. <laughs> uh, so you're going to perform for us now. You're going to do a medley tonight. Yes. Okay, but when you do the tour, you're going to do uh, the whole songs. You're we'll not do gonna, full it's, songs. It's not yeah, going to be right. one long song for the whole uh, time. <laughs> of when, do you, when does the tour start? It starts in April, is that right? Uh, April yeah, 17th. 17th. Okay, oh, where, yeah. where's the first gig? Glasgow. Okay, and are you nervous about that, or I guess you're going to be relieved? When no, it's re really excited, actually. Yeah, yeah really excited. This really is the biggest tour we've ever done, yeah, as separate bands as well. So it's... Exciting, it's going to be huge. It's going to be amazing. One final thing I want to say. I met Tom a little while ago, and you told me uh, that night you were having a baby soon. You haven't had the baby, have you? No, we, uh, the baby's due about two weeks before wow. the first night on tour. Wow, well, that's exciting, and also I would have thought nerve wracking. Yeah, um, yeah, we <laughs> it's the first baby. We don't know what we're doing yet. We're just going to make it up as we go along. Matt's got kids, so I'm getting dad advice from Matt. You've got two children? Two, yes. Uh, do, are any of your tattoos related to children? I mean, not the big skull with the worm going. <laughs> Yes. You have? Yeah, you do. Yes, you do. You don't do. You? Yeah, I've got, I've got a big thing here. What, what have you got there? Yeah. What is this? Time? Well, like, it's not finished yet, but I've got like this. I call my daughter Wiz. Wow. So I've got like this. That's it's not finished yet. Okay, and you have a one daughter and one son, is that right? Yep. What, and you have nothing for your son? No time. Well, I started for my daughter and my ribs, and I was like, man, I've got to commit to the other ribs for him now. But it hurt loads. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> you have a third one, you're really in trouble, aren't you? <laughs> uh, okay, great to have you on the show. Great to know you're back together. And it's going to be fun, isn't it? It's going to be great. huge. Can't When's wait. the album yeah. coming out? Do you, know, you gonna, do you know when you're going to record it? We don't know. Yeah. Later in the year. Okay, and what That's have you written? Just give me one title of one song. What have you written so far? Come on, Tom. Oh, oh, it's it's going to sound really good weird. out of context, though. Um, what well, until I say? The, uh, uh, we've, written, we've written a song called OMFG. OMFG? Yeah. I don't know what that stands yeah. for. It means, oh my, flaming goodness. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. For the older folk. Ladies and gentlemen, they can perform live for you now, but will you say thank you to the fabulous McBusted? <laughs> We're on tour, starting in April, up in Scotland. It's going to be huge. Why don't you go over there and get yourself ready to play? Go over there, centre stage. McBusted will be performing a medley for you live in just a few seconds.